My name is Christine and welcome to Jojo's Chocolates. Today I'm going to demonstrate how to make some Easter chocolate candies for the Easter basket. Now if you tuned in last time I had showed you how to make some long stem roses using a candy mold. Again we're going to use a candy mold but this is a different shape. What we're going to need is our chocolate and our flavoring, the coloring, and then some type of method of warming up our chocolate. So I have got an electric fry pan with about an inch and a half of water and I use glass bowls for melting down my chocolate and then I have separate ones for my colors and my flavors. So today I've chose red and milk chocolate. So let's get started. You're going to need to get a craft brush that you can use to paint the candy mold um, with the melted chocolate that you're using. The ice cream cones that I have that I'm using for the mold, I'm going to start with red. And what I'm going to do is just paint in all of the part of the ice cream on the top just until I can't see through the mold. I don't want to fill it at this point. Then I'm going to do the bottom part which is the cone and I'm going to use milk chocolate today. And again I'm just going to paint that through so you can't see right through that mold. I'm going to use a sucker stick. I'm going to place that in there and then I'm going to come in with my colored in this case it's red and I'm going to fill that all the way to the top of my candy mold. Then I'm going to do the same with the ice cream cone part. I'm going to fill that in with my milk chocolate. Now my sucker stick is now covered and when that is done I want you to tap that mold which brings the air bubbles out and levels that off nice and even. Now this is going to take a good 20 minutes, maybe more depending on the temperature and the humidity, to dry. Once that is dry, what you will end up with is an ice cream cone that in this case is red. And these are so fun and versatile. You can use these for Easter baskets. I've made a few different colors here. I've got green, red, blue, I made an orange and pink. So you can stuff your Easter baskets with these homemade chocolates that look like little ice cream cones. They are so cute, fun, and versatile. A couple other items that I have made are homemade candy bars and some homemade French mints. All of these can be utilized with your basket depending on the mold that you're using for making um, the, the chocolate will depend on the shape that you're going to have as an outcome. Today I hope that I've taught you a few fun and versatile ways of using some more different kinds of candy molds and melted chocolate. My name is Christine. Thank you for joining me today and please visit us at www.jojoschocolates.com